song for this school because I've been trying to, you know, you get me. You don't know I don't know what you're talking about. Just sit down and watch the TV screen. Burn it. Sienna, it got up to the door. Can you it was that bad. And the kids that left school 3 p.m. They actually got to after 8. What? Yes. And of course, when I say the kids, not my kids, I'm still single. Though. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So the experience system was horrible. Really horrible. Okay, so we used the mainland. So give us the mainland experience. I stay on the mainland and coming from Ogba to Kenja. Kedja to Ikosi Road, it was, it was a lockdown. At some point I had to come down and I did a little bit of trekking. Exactly. No, no jokes, I had to trek. For a journey that's less than 20 minutes yeah. from Oregon to Ikosi Road, yeah. it took me close to about two hours. <laughs> I'm not, I'm serious. So yesterday's traffic on the mainland, from Ikeja to Wikosi Road, the way you're approaching that K2 area, yeah. you know, no bus, no everybody stands still. We have to stand at the bus stop. I just had to, you know, I you know when I, are you telling about when your when your kids, not your kids actually, not the biological okay, kids, yeah. kids, kids, actually not married guys, not the your kids, the kids, the kids, your kids, the kids, the kids, the kids, your sister's kids, kids. actually felt bad when they had to stay in school from three to eight, and yeah. they had to go to school this morning. Yes, they had to go to school this morning. Wow. It got to it got to a point wow. where I had to send money to the driver for so they can food. get something for the kids. On the road. Yes. The way that it's actually, happened. it's not the kids, the kids. Yes, I need the kids. I'm single. Okay. He's still single. <laughs> oh. Okay, so my experience was actually very terrible because this is the first time. You know why you tell yourself, you know me, selling yeah. booty pressures. Oh my god, I can't trek. I got to my I'm office. Trek. <laughs> I got to my office in the MBA, <laughs> and from there, I trekked from Greenland Estate down to a Bramadisonia. I did not believe it. That's small. So when I got there, I took a bike from Bramadisonia to um, VGC. Guess so how much it was? 1,000 naira. A journey of just 100 naira, you can imagine. So guys, what do you think can be done to this route? Especially, okay, you talked about the mainland. The mainland actually, the route actually, actually um, We have a lot of, yeah, lot yeah, of lead on time, the yeah, yeah. routes. On the mainland. But on the island, specifically on this axis, the Bramadisonia axis, from that the Bramadisonia down to yeah. Epe, the road is actually narrow, very small, and the runabout is very, very big. What do you think can be done? Because we know that, during the um, Amadeus regime, yeah. he he demolished the runabouts from some, some runabouts from Lekki Phoenix one down to Chevron. But when we got to this axis, they stopped and made the runabout very big, like the um, football pitch. What do you think can be done to expand the road, maybe demolish? Okay, uh, I think uh, let me go back to let me go first to the runabouts. Okay. Yeah. You know when when they just demolish those runabouts, it's uh, they have like a T junction, yeah. So it's easier for you to just take off the runabout and put traffic lights. Okay. But if about this area is not a T junction, you don't have a crossroad. Okay. So it will be very difficult for you to use the traffic light there. But what I think they would do is should reduce the runabout. Okay. And have wide passage for cars to go through. Mm. Yeah, because it, trust me, it's just too big for nothing. Okay. And I wouldn't want them to just they spend a lot of money to construct that fish. Yeah. It's it's Lagos State's uh, money. I wouldn't want them to just throw that fish away. You yeah. understand? But I think something can be done. Yes, reduce the runabout to a very small size 
so I can have good passage for cars to go through. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, um, Princess, maybe any any little idea to because I know there's no drainage system. There's nothing. Yeah. Nowhere water can pass through into a gutter or anywhere. What do you think should be done about that? Um, from what he just said, um, the roundabout is extremely big. Yeah. Really, really big. If you're coming down from Lekki to Acha, the roads are still um a bit. Yeah, they're quite okay. Yeah, yeah. they're quite okay. But after. I have been saying around about down to Strongote, down yeah. to the other areas. Yes, it's very, very narrow. So, okay. There's something can be done. The houses are not actually on the road. So, yeah. it's, yes. But I think some shops are on the road. No, I don't think I don't think so. Coming down from Aja and uh, Borussia down to this. Uh, okay, exactly. Yeah. You're coming, coming from, not, not from Aja. I mean, from a Bamanda store, I feel some shops are on the Okay, those, those shops are actually yes. on the road. They are not, they are, they are how would I put it? Uh, they're not like buildings, they're not yeah. they're, uh, they're, 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 they're yeah, yeah. They are mixed structures. They're yeah, not mixed like structure. they're not really balanced. Okay. Are, some of them are done with wood, some are just caravans. So that can be the angle. Okay. You can just take them off. Okay, that's a bit of the traffic. Let's move to to a little bit of relationship. Um yesterday, I'm sorry, not yesterday, two weeks ago in my SS where I stayed, yeah. um a girl, actually my neighbor. Has a girlfriend and the girl got pregnant and the girl actually came to me they were having a serious conversation of oh the responsible indians and all you know the way they were just straight out yeah and the guy said he was not responsible that anytime he had sex with a girl at any point even when he was drunk i don't know how that is possible that he used condom so my question is is it possible for a woman to get pregnant even with the use of condom yes princess i think you should talk about that <laughs> Okay, I think it's very, very possible. A condom can break. Some people just go to a supermarket and buy a condom without checking the expiry date. Do you understand? So for me, I think it's very, very much possible for a condom to break while you're having sex. So it's possible for a woman to get pregnant. She might not know that the condom. Do you understand? So it's very, very much possible for her to get pregnant. Okay, with a condom. Uh, well, so he, he will explain. Well, I think. Uh, From the main point of view. Yes. yes. I think uh, as a guy, you have to, if you know you're not ready to get a woman pregnant, you should be observant. Because at the end of the day, you're saying condom breaks. Agreed. But if it breaks, you as a guy, you know. Because the feeling changes. Okay. But what's it then that? That's that what I'm saying. If you're not, if you're not, if you're not ready, you stop. It has happened to me before. A personal revelation. It has happened to me before. There was this girl we were, we were on it, and all of a sudden, I started getting a different vibe. The thing, is, oh, the thing was too sweet, and I had to, I had to pause. Yeah. Bring it out a little bit, and finally, the condom. Sorry, it's short. Yeah. Sorry, it's short. Yeah. He said. The man is supposed to feel it in the condom. Breaks. Yes. Right. What about the woman? Is she supposed she to feel it? Too? Okay. I wouldn't know because okay. I'm the man. Okay. okay. I'm not the woman. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm talking about it because I'm wearing it. Yes. If it yes. goes off, I feel it. Oh, okay. So I will know. You understand? But I can say that all the while I've been doing it with a condom, I've never gotten anybody pregnant. History. So to some to some to some extent I can say condom can prevent pregnancy yeah yeah but you as a man you have to be very careful you have to be smart when you're buying your condoms check out for expiration dates because that's one of the re in fact that's the major reason why the condom, the condom will break because expired okay condoms, yeah they okay. always break so that's it that's my opinion now wow wow guys it's been very interesting <laughs> it's been very educative it's all about sex traffic and everything use of condom and everything but don't go anywhere join us by using the hashtag sweet scope join the conversation on facebook twitter and instagram and don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel we'll be right back you're welcome back to the show okay talking about we're still on the topic of condom i had to smile because actually suddenly he was whining <laughs> <his voice. laughs> I, I had the to condom, the condom situation okay. i had to i get it okay now um do maybe you will because I, i'm asking because you're a woman do you why do women not use female condom? Will you be straight for me to say that I don't know how a female condom looks like? What? Yes. Like seriously? I'm sorry guys, but I don't know how a female condom 
Looks like Cecil, so stop looking at me. Because I don't know. Cecil, what do you mean about this? Okay, now I have to dive in, like <laughs> so dive in. Yeah? Because growing up, yeah, they always you always see adverts everywhere. Good circle, direct. You see adverts, use condom, how to use condom yeah. and all that. You see education and Sometimes they bring dido, they show you how to wear it and all that. We've got the education. Sorry, what's but the dido for those who don't understand what dido is? Dido is uh, a, a plastic representation of the dick. Okay. So, <clears throat> so basically, I haven't seen one advert for female condoms. Okay, yeah. It's very, very rare. rare. So, that's why I wasn't surprised when you, when you said. You don't know anything about it. I, I wasn't surprised because I'm, I don't I don't hear it from anywhere. I, I, I don't I don't think myself I've ever used it. So I, I, I don't even know how to wear. So, you can so wear. I think I think you guys should be because they tell us they feel okay. We are the guys. We we get you pregnant. We are responsible. We are all of that. Oh, we wash out. Ladies, you guys should wash out too. Because if, for example, I'm a guy, I'm not watching that, and she's got a female condom on, she's still not going to get pregnant. Okay. Okay. Okay, but something just something just occurred to me as I was talking to you. You know, I feel using the female condom is actually risky. Mm -hmm. Why I'm saying this is because I feel it's gonna be almost the same way with the, with the male condom, right? But all you need to really expand it and you need to spread it because it wants um, vagina is different from the man's um, dick. So I, I, what, what my fear is that when the man penetrates into the woman without maybe she's one wearing the condom, when the man penetrates a woman without using a condom, she's not wearing a condom. I think, for example, when the sex is intense, yeah, when the sex is, yeah, that might go in and that might be another problem. Don't, or don't you think so? Yeah, I, 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 I wouldn't have uh, a strong do, do, do you, do you think I know what you're talking about. Yeah, I know, what she's, yes. I know what she's talking about, but the thing is, I don't even, yeah, I'm a guy, I don't even know how this thing works. I don't even know if it's safe to use a female condom. I don't even know how I've not seen it before. That's so, so I think I think I think a research should be done. We should go know about no, it. No, it. Probably gonna educate these people. people. Okay. Yeah, I think we should do that. Okay. I know if I leave all of us in this video to actually talk about sex, condom, um uh what you call it and the traffic in Lagos we would not leave here. But guys, we have to go. Don't forget Play safe. If you don't want to get a woman pregnant as a man, please use condom. And make sure you check, you check the expiration date when the condom is going to expire so that it will not bust. And you're not saying, but I was using condom. Okay, join us same time, same place next week on Sweet Scope. Bye for now. Peace out.